MacDonald Henry is one fisherman who shared his views on camera with GBN earlier on Thursday. He says the issue has existed for close to two years. It should be the release to perseverance, as you can see. And um, I think the manager should do something about it and the, and the supervisor. But they do nothing at all. Every day they watch it and just go back. I complained several times to, to, to the manager and he does nothing about it. We seem to be not concerned at all. We need that the manager should get the bob chat and get this garbage out and take it to perseverance. All of it, the whole ramp, the whole, whole ramp is the same thing. GBN through investigation understands that about 40% of the garbage in the area is deposited by the ocean as a result of high tides. And according to management of the facility, a large portion of what occurs falls squarely in the laps of the concerned fishermen who on a daily basis throw away food boxes and other items in their possession where they congregate at the back of the fish market. Although they did not want to appear on camera, we were told also that the area is often cleaned and a major operation will take place in the coming days. However, Mr. Henry believes that the entire parish of St. Andrew has been abandoned by the relevant authorities as it relates to sanitary and other conditions. The whole of St. Andrews has been dim, dim. We have no manager, uh, Minister of Agriculture in looking at the place. We have no sanitary inspector looking at the place. And, you know, we're just living here just as pigs. Pigs. That can happen in St. George's at all. No way. It can't happen in Tongue. But they have us here as pigs. Eugenia Peters, GBN News.